Marriage is about homophobia that is needless and unjust against gay, lesbian, bi and transgender teens. Now, I want to tell you the story of Asher Brown. Asher was a boy who lived in the United States. He was good-natured, he was intelligent, and he was happy. Apart from when he was in school, when he was just bullied relentlessly for who he was, told day after day that he was needless, that he was a disease, that he should just burn in hell for who he was, and that the best thing he could do in the world was to just go home and kill himself. So one day after school, Asher went home, found his father gun, and did just that. Asher was 13 years old. Who in this room is 13? Anyone? Now imagine that homophobia is a flower. And I know that that's kind of a bad analogy because, well, the flower is very nice looking, so I don't know, imagine homophobia is a rose, you know, full of pricks. <laughs> um, you want the rose. I don't think anyone in this room has it in them to tell anybody that they should go and kill themselves. I don't think anyone in this room has that kind of evil within them. So you've got to think, well, where does the homophobia come from? And how can we stop it? So if homophobia is a rose, then what does a rose need to grow? It needs air, it needs water, it needs light. So how can we stop it? Put it in a box. Now, how does that, how does that uh, affect it? Well, if it can't get a light, water or air, then it, it dies, it withers and dies. So how can we be the box? How can we be this box that will just cut off all of its life and just kill it in the end? If you hear someone on the street saying the words gay, or that's so gay, or queer, puff, faggot, just tell them to stop. You don't even need to be gay to tell someone. I mean, I am, but that's beside the point. Just tell them to stop. And I know it's like littering. I know it's like littering. You see someone littering, you're supposed to tell them to stop, but you don't, you don't want to, because, yeah. Someone else will do it, but no, please. Littering and telling someone to stop littering just makes the streets look a bit cleaner. But if you tell someone to stop saying these words that can put into the mind of a gay boy or a gay girl or anyone that they should go and kill themselves and that they're worthless, you can actually save a life. So, thank you. <laughs>